Egypt, 95 million years ago. In the modern day, the country is nearly entirely covered by desert, but in the late Cretaceous, this was not the case. A rainforest intersected by productive wetlands encompassed the landscape. Conifer trees and ferns are abundant, and giant fish prowl the waterways. The true rulers of this land, however, are the dinosaurs. Parala Titan. This titanosaur is the largest animal on the continent. He is 70 feet long and weighs 60 tons. At this size, even apex predators steer clear unless they are desperate or working together. But to maintain such a large body, Parala Titan must eat hundreds of pounds of food per day. Sauropod teeth are needle-like and not built to grind plants. Instead, they use them to pull as much food from the trees as possible and allow their colossal stomachs to handle the processing, sometimes aided by gastroliths or stomach stones. There is one thing, however, that could threaten such a colossus, the weather. The region is plagued by seasonal monsoons and flash floods. Lightning, rushing waters and high winds could all be dangerous for such a large animal. He's trying to flee the lowlands to avoid the soon-to-be-rising water, but he is not fast. This hill above the river is high enough to escape flooding, but another threat looms. Lightning. Downsides, but smaller animals have survived worse. The real killer is the fall. A tragedy, but death by lightning is rare even among sauropods. This male was simply unlucky. But when his body makes landfall downstream, scavengers will soon arrive to take advantage of the unexpected feast. <laughs>